Hi there. In this video, I will talk about how you can create a function with multiple parameters like we created earlier, but you will return also the multiple values. And that's the catch where we will use a tuple which I showed you or explained you in one of the previous videos. All right. So let's start with our circle area function. So maybe first of all, let's go ahead and import a math. And let's define the function which is circle underscore area and maybe our requirement is that uh, we want to pass multiple radiuses so maybe radius 1 and radius 2 once we do that then we have area 1 is equals to um, pi r square so math dot pi multiply with radius 1 square Right. and then for area 2 similar equation math dot pi radius 2 and 2 so far we have been returning only just one value but when you return two value it is returned as a tuple so to do that what we need to simply do is uh, come here as return and say area 1 comma area 2 Similarly, if you have even multiple arguments like radius 3, radius 4, and number of arguments, you can specify and return it like this. Right? So, when we call this function, we will assign it to a multiple variables like a1, comma a2 is equals to circle underscore area, and then pass the a first radius and pass the pass second radius. I hit enter circle underscore area let's see what it say she is return area one area circle underscore area is not defined okay let's see yes. I R C O E underscore area I go in and execute it again Execute this, yeah. Maybe I have not executed this one, that's why it was so uh, you know saying that. Okay, so of that, if I want to print the first one, this is a1, and uh, if I say a2, I will get the value of second area in a2. So, this is how using the tuples or an output in the form of tuple you can get it back from your function when there is a need that there are multiple calculations and you need to return that and that's what it's make it more interesting because in real life you just don't return one single values but there are multiple values so for example if you are doing a machine learning algorithm you know you want to return uh, let's say uh, you know what is the uh, error rate and other parameters like uh, p values and things like that and just combine all of those into one single uh, tuple and give it back to your output so this is how you can do this and uh, get the output back from your function now as part of an exercise what you can do is like we have been doing in previous ex exercises as well you can take the circumference of the circle and return the multiple uh, circumferences by passing the radius and you are aware that the circumference formula for circle is 2 pi r so like this we have return area 1 and area 2 you can return circumference 1 circumference 2 by using a formula 2 pi r similar in this notation all right so hope you enjoy the exercise and i'll meet you in the new video